piece of art has a new home in a New Mexico church. You can now find the 100-year-old altar imported from France in Hobbs. News 13 Cheyenne Cope was there today and talked to the local artist who spent months restoring it. This black walnut altar is now the centerpiece of the chapel at St. Helena's Catholic Church in Hobbs. And I want to leave a mark, my contribution to this parish by providing few things that people can remember. Father Ricardo says he's been working to bring more art and beauty to the church and that this altar is a part of that. It was purchased from a monastery in Europe and spent a few years in storage before making its way to St. Helena. Larry Wilcox first saw the altar when he was volunteering to help move it. Being an artist himself, he noticed it needed some work, so he volunteered to help restore it. The wood was very, very dry. The wood was uh, crumbling, deteriorating. They found out that it had uh, termite, uh, termites. Wilcox worked for months to get it back to its original condition and says the project turned out to be much more than he anticipated. It was like, well, I'll get, I'll get, this, I'll get this done real quick, and I've done my volunteer work, you know, for the year. But as life would have it, a lot of times uh, the, uh, the circumstances we find ourselves in demands more of us. But he is happy to have been a part of it and says it helped him feel a connection to his beliefs. I kind of embraced that. I mean, at least, at least that was the, the choice I tried to make for um, not only for, you know, the pastor and, and the, 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 the um, chapel here, but uh, also personally. In Hobbs, Cheyenne Cope, KRQE News 13. The church is now focusing on restoring a kneeling bench that was also crafted in France.